New at 6, scientists at ASU make an out-of-this-world idea a reality. Yeah, it's no easy mission. They're being tasked with coming up with ways to use a state-of-the-art space station. Tonight, Cameron Pullum introduces us to the brains behind the project. Just 1,200 miles above our heads, a new world of space innovation will soon begin. Exploration is just in the human genome. We are going to explore space. You have to envision things in your mind before they can become reality. ASU researchers like Dr. Lindy Elkins-Tanton and Jessica Rosé are helping to lead our world into that new frontier. This is not just a blueprint or a napkin scratch. It's actually happening. In just 10 short years, the Orbital Reef Space Station will begin its low Earth orbit. Already under construction, it will be the team at ASU helping to come up with ways to use it, connecting our world's brightest minds to its unique capabilities. On Orbital Reef, companies can rent what are basically pods that come with all of the things they need to get started, so to speak. You know, the comms, the life support. Those companies and researchers are then able to conduct experiments, developing everything from new technologies to even medicine to benefit us back here on Earth, taking advantage of the microgravity environment. I am going to be uh, very interested in seeing uh, what comes forth, what kinds of businesses emerge in space. It's also about changing humanity's perspective by experiencing what's called the overview effect, something bound to happen to all those who step foot on the new station. When you're on the space station looking back at the Earth, you suddenly realize that you know, your quibble with your neighbor doesn't really matter and that we are one humanity on our own planet. And that kind of perspective can help us to face the challenges we have here on Earth. A feeling they hope to use to inspire the next generation of scientists reaching for the stars. I'm Cameron Polum, ABC 15, Arizona.